In this tutorial, you will learn how to use JumpCloud Protect's push authentication to log in to the user portal. To begin, go to your user portal and type in your username and password. Click the User Login button to continue. If you've completed the setup for mobile push notifications, you'll see this as an option for multi-factor authentication. Select JumpCloud Identity Mobile Push to start the process. Click the Send Login Request to Mobile Device button to activate the push authentication. Once sent, you will see a message that the request has been made and you should see it pop up on your mobile device. Tap the push notification on your mobile device to begin the confirmation process. When JumpCloud Protect opens, you will see the details of the login request, including organization name, email address used for the login, IP address, and general location where the request was made. Be sure to inspect these requests carefully, and then tap Approve. If you approve the request, both of your device screens will show it and you will be successfully logged in. However, if you decline the request, your mobile device will acknowledge it and you will be sent back to the JumpCloud User Portal login screen. You will want to decline authentication if the notification was not triggered by you. This is one way multi-factor authentication and push notifications protect your identity. Check out our other tutorial videos and KB articles on MFA and the Protect app.